So, uh, so my name is Chris, and uh, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to just give a little bit of context what Unicef Innovation is, and where the kind of idea for the venture. I, I really think that the technology is pretty special, but until you try that very, very time. We cannot have business as usual in our delivery of services to the people if we are going to reach our targets. We have many problems including the burgeoning population. If you are going to reach the unreached, and we always say we don't want to leave anyone behind, if we are going to reach the unreached, we have to innovate. I just had my first experience of VR and it was super cool. VR technologies are very cool. So for people like me, if they engage it in school activities, most people will want to participate in it and it will help people like me learn faster and easier. VR is introduced into education in Nigeria, it will go a long way because students will be able to understand better because they will be able to see what they are being taught and it will, it will improve the understanding and assimilation of the students. The event has been interesting. You can get a phone and put it inside the VR and if VR is used in school, it will be faster and easier for children like me and others. I'm so excited, first of all, about the UNICEF Innovation Fund. I've heard about it, but to understand how it operates, uh, it was exciting for me. But I was also keen to listen to the young people who came on what they are doing. Even those who may not get funding from the Innovation Fund, the kind of ideas they have on how we can improve the welfare of people. I've never done VR before, but now I'm going to go and learn more now because of this event. So um, I want to thank UNICEF and MEC3D for hosting the event.